Heat, by the way, they will uh, take on the Magic tomorrow. And I'm glad that they're back in action already. It's been a while. Um, the uh, the Heat going to be interesting now. They're eight and seven in their last fifteen. I want to see how they play over the next couple of weeks. They got several uh, road games coming up too, so we're going to find out a lot about this team over the next couple of weeks. And I think if you end up going around five hundred again. I, I, I think we're going to find out who they are. I think, I'm sorry, let me phrase it the right way. I think you will now know who they are. Because you're 8-7 and seven in your last 15. You got, you know, 15 games already? That's, that's a month. You go a couple more weeks of this, now you're talking about a large portion of the season. That's no longer a funk. That's no longer, oh, we're, we're struggling right now. We got some injuries. Uh, guys can't find their groove, whatever, all that kind of, all those, in, all those excuses are out the window. You can't, you can't, there's no using that stuff. If you go on for the next, you know, eight to 10 games, 12 games, and you're doing kind of the same thing you did in your last 15, we know who you are now. And you're probably that team, not the one from the first two months. Which, by the way, if, if that's the case, man, that's going to be depressing. It really is. It's, it, it, it's one of those where it's going to be frustrating to an extreme, pretty much. Because we were drinking the Kool-Aid in the first couple of months, thinking, okay, this is a legit team. And, you know, when it's a week or two or three weeks and they're doing it and you're drinking the Kool-Aid, okay, I get it. But they do it for two months and you think, okay, you know what, this, they're for real. And over the next couple of weeks, if they go back to being just average, mediocre, like what they've been the last 15 games, that's going to take all the wind out of the sails for me because I'm going to go back to where I thought they were, and that's going to be like, oh, okay, all right. I wasn't really setting myself up this season for a lot. I told you guys, 7-8 seed, first-round exit. I'm not expecting that much. That's usually what you get with one All-Star. Well, they got two All-Stars now because Bam's played like an All-Star, and congratulations to him. He deserves to be in that game. I'm glad for him. But, wow. If they are this team from the last 15, that's depressing. It really is. It's going to be a shame because it's just going to look like Miami peaked in the first two months while everybody else was kind of, you know, trying to figure things out. And now, now they're peaking and the Heat can't get any better than where they were before. Hell, they're not even as good as they were the first two months right now. This isn't a replay of that 31-10 and 10 team. They're like, we were all, yeah, look, and bond, 13 in a row. And then to just slowly fall apart. Yeah. Uh, I, well, no, they didn't. That's... Obviously, we're younger, blah, but you but know it, what I mean? That, that feeling of we were here and now we're being dropped. Down yeah. to here, you know. The, the run. We'll find yeah. out. We'll find out. I mean, only time is going to answer that if these guys are fraud. This road, you, like you were talking about a couple base, days ago, the road ba- trip coming yeah. up, and yeah. everything. Like this is this. We're going to really the, find out. Yeah, that's what I said. The next couple of weeks, we're going to find out. And if you're anything like you were in the last fifteen, then we know what you are already. And you are what we've seen in this last second half, not the first half of it. That's all. It's a shame, man. But that, that's, that's the reality of where we're at with the Heat. And let me tell you, for your psyche, this is an important one on Saturday. You took care of business at home, but you're better than them. You're supposed to beat them at home and away. And you've lost, you know, 9 of 13 before they won, the one you won the other night. Now you got to win again. 
And and you must win. I think you've got to get on some kind of a roll and don't allow anything that has set in the last 15 games to continue to set in. But I tell you, the next 10, 12 games, you're, you're going to know a lot about your Heat team after this one. 